Number eight Ohio State hosted number seven Minnesota on Saturday night in a game that also served as a farewell for seven Buckeye seniors and graduate students. When it came time for business, Minnesota drew first blood off a backhand tap from senior forward Blake McLaughlin, putting the score at one nothing in favor of the Golden Gophers. Junior forward Tate Singleton evened things up moments later at one apiece, finishing his goal with a hair slick selly in front of the home crowd. The Golden Gophers would retake the lead with a power play goal from sophomore forward Mason Nevers just a few minutes later. Minnesota closed the first period with two more goals, including this one from senior forward Sammy Walker. In the third period, freshman forward Rhett Pitlick scored his second of two goals in the game, which prompted Ohio State head coach Steve Rollick to send in junior goaltender Ryan Snowden to replace freshman goaltender Jakob Dobish for the remainder of the game. Minnesota appeared to have scored goal number six against Snowden, but an Ohio State challenge prompted an official review that sent Minnesota senior defenseman Ben Brinkman back to the locker room for the rest of the contest. Tensions flared a couple times, and Ohio State had a couple looks at a goal to cut into the lead, but ultimately it was not to be, as the final score gave Minnesota the victory over Ohio State 5-1. to one. The Buckeyes travel to Michigan Friday and Saturday, February 18th and 19th, to close out their regular season schedule against the number four Wolverines. For the Lantern, I'm Caleb Spinner.